Hello, I'm Chef Spencer Henkel, and welcome to my backyard on the beautiful Gulf Coast of Florida, where we bring you the latest edition of Lux Chef. Today, I'm joined by Dale Sanders, lifestyle and travel editor at Lux Beat Magazine, who will be filming this episode. So let's head into the kitchen and start cooking. Greetings and welcome to another episode of Lux Chef. I'm Chef Spencer Henkel. Now that we're in the dog days of summer, I would be remiss if I didn't show you a grilled peaches recipe. First, let me thank Steve Reichman in Portland, Oregon for turning me on to this recipe. Uh, it's super easy, grilled peaches served with vanilla ice cream and an easy to make brandy sauce. And one little tip up front is make sure that you, uh, when you go to the grocery store to buy your peaches, Make sure that they're freestone peaches so that you can cut them in half and free them from the pit. Uh, cling stones won't do that, so you might ask your uh, uh, produce guy about that. All right, let's get started with the uh, ingredients. First thing are the peaches, the stars of the show. Make sure you get freestone peaches, as I said before, so that you can cut them in half like this and just pull those stones right out of there. Um, you're going to need to brush a little bit of oil on them just so they don't stick to the grill. And then we're going to put them on a medium-high grill. Actually, I'm going to bring this over here. Okay. You know, Cooking these guys really brings the flavor out in them. It's just amazing what it does. Now, simultaneously, we're going to put this pot on the, to the grill, and I'm going to put in a quarter of a cup of butter, unsalted butter, a half a cup of brown sugar, about a half a teaspoon of cinnamon, if you like, and two tablespoons of brandy. And we're just gonna let those things meld together and we're going to just pull it off of the flame and set it aside. As they cook, I like to take a little bit of this brandy sauce and just kind of slather it on there. What it'll do is it'll soften up the skin a little bit. The skin won't even be an issue. Um, you, you know, you can peel them if you want. Uh, I've found that uh, it, it's just not worth it. It uh, doesn't uh, detract from the texture or the taste of the peaches. Beautiful. That's really coming together nicely. I'll give it a few more minutes. So we're not going to turn these over. We're going to just turn them a quarter turn uh, with the face down. All right, I'm going to take the uh, sauce off the grill and um, I'm going to put the lid on. That'll speed up the cooking just a little bit. So what I'm going to do is let these cook. It's probably going to take about 10 minutes and I'll be back. I'm going to turn these a quarter turn now. And boy, they're, they're starting to get nice and soft. Oh boy, these are going to be really delicious. Show you what that looks like. Grill marks. We're just about there. I'm going to let these go for another couple of minutes and uh, it's dessert time. I'm going to stir this up a little bit. And uh, let me show you what it looks like. All right, I think these peaches are done. So 
I'm going to plate them. scoop of ice cream. And for the coup de gras, we're going to put this syrup on here. Wow, this is a super easy dessert you can make right on your barbecue grill. Now, I made a brandy sauce today, but if you could try other toppings like maybe some balsamic vinegar or pomegranate molasses, how about this? How about some melted chocolate with chopped pecans? Oh man, I mean. Well, I hope you'll try this recipe. It's super easy to make and uh, your guests will love it. It's a wonderful summertime dessert. And you gotta do it when the peaches are ripe. These peaches are absolutely fantastic. So I will see you again soon on the next episode of Love Chef.